In this lesson, we want to explain section tool. To do this, enter the tool in library and then sections. There is only one item here. We insert the section cube in a scene and put it in a desired place. You can move it with the translate tool anywhere. As you can see, this tool cut all geometries. And you can see inside the building. Very beautiful. You can also rotate it with the rotate tool. An important tool is resize it with a scale tool. When you choose a scale, there are handle that you can use to change dimension of the cube as you can see. You can by clicking and dragging this handle to change the dimension of the cube. Okay. <clears throat> Going to settings, you can enable or disable this tool here. Enable. And in a color, you can change the color effect that shows the cut location happen here. This effect is determined by thickness. If you set it to zero, the cut is made exactly at the edge of edge of cube as you can see the cut is exactly at the border of the cube but if you increase the number of thickness a little you can see that a little offset is appear here this cut is not exactly at the there is an offset that you can determine the thickness as you can see and now you can change the color as you want in the invert you can reverse how to execute these tools that is only object inside the cube are seen and the rest disappear from view and a clipping mask which is both by default you can specify whether it is two cuts on geometries or point clouds or both For point collab, please refer to previous lessons that I told you how to import the point collab. Okay, you can use this tool as many times as you want in a different places of the scene. And you can access them by clicking on a scene manager to access the settings. Okay. Hello my friends, to continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now, you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.